All right, hi court. Okay, here is your style box rundown. Um, I am going to talk about each item on its own and then I'm gonna talk about how to mix and match all the pieces to make different outfits. Um, so, first I'm gonna start with this tank. This tank is amazing. Um, I did a V-neck because V-neck is actually super flattering, especially when you're layering, which is what the idea with this is. This is part of our basics line. We can literally, we cannot keep our basics in stock because the feel and the fit is amazing and they blouse just right. So um, I have this in three colors. I pit chose this color because I think it's great for fall and it's gonna go great paired back to your jackets. Um, so you have this, so you can feel it. It's so soft. It has this rounded hem, which is actually very flattering if you're going to wear it with like leggings down. I personally would front tuck this when I wear it with denim, okay? So, um, front tuck, let me show you how to front tuck. So, this is a sweater, so it's gonna lay just a little bit differently than that's going to lay, but I'll kind of show you how to do it um, with this anyway. So you pull this out, twist. So you're gonna make a little twist, a little knot, and then you're gonna tuck that into your um, pant line, and then you're gonna kind of blouse it, and then if this is hanging down kind of weird like that, if you like how it looks, leave it, but I would tuck it up a little bit all the way around, okay? And then it's just gonna kind of, you can wiggle a little bit and it's gonna just fall into a natural place, okay? So this does a couple of things. It elongates your legs, so it's taking from your legs from looking like they're this long to looking like they're this long, right? So you're gaining like a, almost, almost a foot of um, leg length. It's also bringing in your waist, Okay, giving yourself a waist, giving yourself some shape, that's always a good thing. And then it's also giving you a blousing effect right here, which is going to hide things like my mom belly. Okay, so that's why I love the front tuck. Um, so, that's the tank. We also have it in white and black right now. Yours is the charcoal gray. This is great in the summer just by itself um, because it has thicker straps so it's going to cover your bra straps so very bra friendly in the fall right now I gave you two lighter jackets that you can put over the top of that tank I picked this color for you because I think it will be beautiful on you I also picked it because it's very similar to the yellow jacket that you already have that I know that you love and wear a lot so I just wanted to add another thing in your closet that I think you'll love as much as that Anything that you, any outfits that you make with your yellow jacket, make the same outfits with this. And then this feels a little more fall and the yellow feels kind of summery. Um, this jacket has drawstrings at the bottom and then it has a roll tab sleeve. Anytime you have something that's adjustable, always undo it and redo it to your body, okay? So like this, when you put it on, I recommend untying it, putting it on, cinching it a little bit to your body and then you're gonna do a slip knot. You're gonna put a slip knot, slip knot back in it. Let me show you how. Um, I feel like that was kind of a struggle. I'll get better at that, but um, hopefully you got kind of the idea. You can do the knot up closer to make the string shorter, but if you want to let it hang down, that's fine too, it just adds some detail. The sleeve, again, you're gonna unbutton this, you're gonna roll it down, you're gonna roll it back up to the proper sleeve length on you, which should hit you know, right below the elbow, um, depending on where you want it, really, but I would do right below the elbow, and then you're just gonna snap it back, okay? If you ever try on a jacket like this that has the sleeves rolled already and it feels tight in the shoulders, before you go up a, a size in the jacket, always try to re unroll the sleeves and re-roll them because that could be what's causing it to be tight up here. I also love that this jacket and this cardigan are light enough that you can wear them all day. So it's not like a heavier leather jacket or a coat where when you get inside you're gonna get kinda hot and take it off. You're gonna be able to wear this all day. So I picked out olive because green looks great on you. Um, I have this in two other colors, but big fan of the olive. It's long. This is gonna look great with your tank and some leggings. It's also gonna look great with your tank front tucked into denim. Skinny jean, dark wash skinny jean, and then an ankle booty. That would look awesome. 
Um, if you wear this with the tank and some leggings, throw on a sneaker. Okay, that would be really fun too. Love this guy. Okay, so now I'm gonna show you what each outfit looks like together and I'm gonna throw the jewelry in there too. So, tank with the jacket. And then you're front tucking it, right? Throw this on with some light wash denim or some dark wash denim. You could even throw it on with a dress pant for work. So you have two solids here. So you want to add some sort of pattern. So I picked out this great necklace for you. I think that you pull off fun jewelry really well. It's one of my favorite things about you. So I added this because it adds just a kind of a pop of some color and some interest and just really pulls the whole look together. And then when you have denim on, like a dark wash denim, it's gonna pull the blue out of this necklace too. Okay, and then I picked you out these earrings. I love that you wear big earrings. I think they look great on you. Um, I, if I were you and I had your awesome style, I would pair these two together because you can totally pull it off. I am a little more minimalist, so I would wear these and then I'd wear a smaller necklace or I'd wear bigger earrings and a, um, or I'd wear a statement necklace and then a smaller earring. But part of what makes your style your style is your awesome jewelry. So I, if I were you, I'd pair these together, but know that there's the other option too. So this completes this look. Okay. Hold please. Okay, so we're going to do the exact same look with the cardigan. If you wanted to wear this with your legging, since you added kind of a fancy necklace and you may wear your fancy um, earrings, Instead of doing a sneaker with this and leggings, throw on an ankle boot and it really dresses it up, okay? So it's all about the accessories. Accessories are really what takes an outfit from feeling casual to dressy. But this is gonna look great just with denim and booties as well. Um, and then a little front tuck. If you do the dark wash blue jeans, then the blue is going to pull out the blue in the necklace and the cardigan is going to pull out the green in the necklace. So this is going to be a very balanced outfit. Okay, so that's all your pieces.